Nokia have partnered with MakerBot, one of the leaders in the 3D printing industry, uh, to really bring customization through 3D printing to more of our devices, namely the Lumia 820 and the Lumia 520. We have been enabling customization in our products since you know, the early 2000s with devices like the uh, 3210 with removable fascias, for example. So with that kind of interest in customization and the ability of 3D printing to offer really unique customizable cases and solutions to you know, our future customers, there's a natural interest and a natural fit. So we're here showing off the technology, printing out the cases and showing people what they can do to personalize their Nokia Lumia 520s and, and 820s. Well the 3D printing initiative is an open source project. We've released the files, uh, the CAD files for the Lumia 520 and the Lumia 820 online. The idea of releasing those files is to allow consumers to customize and print their own back covers. Now we know not every consumer is going to be able to do this, but we know that you know, in the future we may well get to that place. And the idea came kind of out of that when I go out, I don't always want to bring all my keys with me, um, but I always carry my phone, so therefore I did this design where I can keep my key in my phone. So we have uh, MakerBot here with us as our partners. We have several MakerBot devices, and what we do is we're allowing consumers to actually get a social 3D printed Nokia case. The idea is that a consumer can tweet using the hashtag Lumia820. From that tweet, we'll take that consumer's Twitter handle and we'll create a personalized case for them with that Twitter handle. So the consumer will actually walk away with a Lumia820 with a customized case just for them. I mean, who else has, uh, has a brand new phone with his, his Twitter handle on the back? That's pretty nice. I'm trying to find a word to describe it. I think we'll go with awesome.